So most of you have heard of Placeit. It is the place that I go to for my mock-ups, for my t-shirt mock-ups. I've posted them uh, on Instagram and on Twitter and all the social medias. It's a great place, I love it for that. But they also have t-shirt templates. So you can go on there and actually make t-shirts on there. I'm gonna show you how to do it. We're gonna go and do some Christmas t-shirt designs using the templates on Placeit. Let's go. Hey everyone, it's Juno with Detour Shirts. In this video, we're gonna go and use Placeit to create t-shirt designs for Christmas. More specifically, the ugly Christmas sweater t-shirt design, the ones that are pixelated. Uh, they have tons of designs on there, so you can go and create your own, kind of mix match some different things, and I'm gonna show you how easy it is to do that, to change the colors, use the fonts, and all those things. So let's get into Placeit right now, and I'll show you how to get there and how to do this. All right, so here we are on Placeit, placeit.net. Um, this is what you'll see. You can see most of the things on here are for mock-ups. You can mock up uh, different products as well as t-shirts, and they have templates. So they're right on the front page. There's Hanukkah templates, uh, gaming templates, and there's so much more. And you can see there's also templates for like social media stuff and things like that. So what we're gonna concentrate on today is, there's lots to do here on Placeit, but what we're gonna concentrate on today is Christmas t-shirt design right there, boom. And we're gonna break it down even further, but I just wanted to show you, even for Christmas, there's some really cool uh, artwork here that you can use from there and some Krampus things and some skeleton things and you know, you got some really cool stuff. I love these like here, it almost looks like tarot cards. So I bet you could make it look like tarot card stuff. And you can see 12 pages of just Christmas stuff. So we're gonna have to narrow it down. I'm gonna do ugly Christmas sweater, uh, ugly Christmas sweater. Let's see if that pulls it up. Yeah, so look at this, this is amazing. Uh, this, these kinds of things really sell well during Christmas. I don't know if you've seen these, but uh, if you can make something different, like don't copy these, we're gonna use these as templates and then change them. But you can see there's tons of them. Like you got vintage gaming, gaming is huge. Um, you got Santa Claus, of course, Hanukkah stuff. Like they're all, you can all kind of mix and match these. So I could take this and put it on here and take this and put it on there and so on. And you know, got this kind of thing. So think about what you're gonna do and see if there's something on here and change it up. So I'm going to show you how to change it up. I'm going to take this Falala Lama here. And you can see there's also other ones right here that you can use. Now the trick about this is I think it's 4000 by 4000. So it's a little bit smaller than 4500 by 4500. So we're going to go try and do it edge to edge all the way edge to edge. So uh, first thing first, you can do a llama, but I'm going to change it just to show you that can change everything. You can see right here it says edit and I'm just gonna pick anything under here. Like you can see, again, the library is big, right? I can do any one of these and it just keeps going and going. I'm scrolling and scrolling. You can see Turkey and it keeps going. It stopped for a little bit, but it keeps going. So I'm gonna go to the top and it has different things like rams and llamas and things. It even has Godzilla kaiju here. So I'm gonna do that, replace it. Okay, so instead of fa la la lama, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna change the words too. So I'm gonna say, uh, have a, um, I'm gonna just do have a kaiju Christmas. How about that? Okay, so that's, we wanna center that, boom. Or we could make it bigger to the edge there. And we can move that to the top. Yeah. Uh, kaiju, so we only have this bottom one, so that's gonna be Christmas. So let's do Christmas, great. And then we can duplicate this. So we can come in here, duplicate, boom. So now we have have a, have a, right? So we're gonna do this one as Kaiju. So I'm gonna come over here, Kaiju. Uh, actually, I want it all caps. So I'm gonna keep all caps, Kaiju, good. And I'm gonna move that right there. And then we can move these things down, right? Remember, we wanna go edge to edge. Uh, and then we can change this one. So let's see if there's a, another one. So this one is this one at the top, right? 
see right there, so I can change it to this. Look at that. And I can just make that bigger to match. Boom. Right? And I didn't show you, we can change the color. So if I don't want this, that color, I can come in here uh, and change it. So let's say, oh, right here, color, sorry. Yeah, and then I can change it to like green or something, right? You know, because green, green Godzilla. Uh, and then we can change these too, the colors right here. Have a, let's do white, right? White. And maybe we want this green. I don't know. Let's try. Yeah, that could be cool. And then we could change the colors in these things too. So if we went up here and we wanted green, you know, we could be white and green. Now the background color, we're going to remove it when we save it, but let's change the color to see what it would look like on red, right? So green and red. Maybe this isn't the best thing. Maybe we want to change this to white. Let's see what it would look like with white. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, but it kind of loses the two colors. So let's go back and maybe something light green like that. Or light. Yeah, either one. Play around with those colors. Okay, and the bottom one, I kind of want to do the other one too. So let's change this. To something a little more thin. What is this thing? Oh, that has paws. That kind of would be good for like cats or something. Let's try this. No, don't like it. Don't like it. I kind of like this one. Um, but could we switch it and make it upside down? Yes, we can. Right there. Cool. So it's coming together, right? I have a Kaiju Christmas. Perfect. Now what I didn't show you is you can actually change the fonts too. So right now it's this night things, but, uh, oh, Kaju. But look at all these fonts that it has. You can pick any one of these um, if, if, it, if you want. Now it also has, um, I think this one actually had some other ones. So let's see. Yeah, there we go. Here are some other ones that uh, are pixelated. So we got five by seven. That's kind of a rounded one. Got Berg here, not really pixelated. This one, that doesn't look like sweater, but this one actually says Christmas sweater. That, that one's kind of a cool thing. Costura, you can see the hash um, comic. That one kind of has a pixelated look, heavy data. Um, home sweet home. Oh, that one's cool. That one's kind of like the night things, a uh, king things. Why did I say night? Uh, king things, yeah, kind of cool. Uh, and then home sweet home thicker. That's a really cool design. So we could change these to say home sweet home. Let's try that. I like that look better. So we can search for these or it's already saved. Have a Kaiju Christmas. Let's see what Christmas looks like with home sweet home. Isn't that cool? Home sweet. I like that look. Okay. Well, there we go. And then we can make Kaiju bigger. Boom. And maybe instead of Christmas, we can do Xmas to um, just save some space. Let's try that. Yeah, that's looking good. Have a Kaiju Xmas. That's really cool. Okay, so whatever we want to do, you can see we can play around with different things. We got tons of different graphics, tons of different fonts we can use, and tons of these where we can put it up and down. And we, I could have put one in the middle too, just to have some space. So once we're done with this, I'm gonna uh, take out the background so we can do this right here, boom. And then I'm gonna download this. So get rid of this. Um, and I gotta scroll up, there it was. And then I can just download. And now it's going to process here and I'm going to show you how big it is. I'm going to, I'm going to actually put it on a red bubble just as it is. So you can see the size of it. So I'm going to click download here and we'll go into red bubble and let's see the size compared to the t-shirt. All right. So here I am on red bubble. I'm going to go to my downloads folder and drag in that one that we just did. It's PNG. I didn't do anything to it. Uh, it's a transparent PNG but it's about 4,000 by 4,000. 
Let's see what it looks like on a t-shirt. Of course, we're gonna have to color it. And there you go. It's actually 60%, so I can make it bigger. And look at that, have a Kaiji Christmas. I can even do it on this one. Um, there we go. And it works perfectly on there for the t-shirt. Now it may not fit every single one, like, uh, well, it works on, this would be a cool, uh, cool phone case, let's see. Ooh, that red might be too bright. Okay. And of course I can go back and change the colors, but I'm just showing you that it works, right? Look at that. You have a cool, look at that right there. That's pretty neat. Okay, uh, it doesn't work for a sticker because we made things white, but it would be a cool pillow. Let's do this. Yeah. Again, we made it for a t-shirt, so it's gonna work the best on a t-shirt, but you can go in here and try it out on different products and, and see what it would look like on Redbubble. Again, I, I didn't do anything else. I downloaded it straight from Placeit, and it works on a lot of these products, right? Like this, this apron right here. Uh, let's do, boom. Uh, oh, we gotta enable it. And then maybe even have to make it a little smaller. Have a kaiju Christmas, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Anyway, so you can see it works perfectly and there's tons of them on there, so get started. Uh, you wanna put these out before Black Friday, you got about a week to make these, but you can see I made these in a couple of minutes, so you wanna take this weekend or whatever it is to make these, and again, you can make these for, for next year too if you're missing it and you watch this video a little too late after or, or during Christmas. These will sit on here and they'll be on here for next year too. So if you have something really funny uh, that will work all the time every Christmas, then you know it'll be here again. So hopefully this was really helpful for you. So there you go. That's how easy it is to create a design, an ugly Christmas sweater design specifically on Placeit. Uh, again, there's tons of uh, different things you can go on there. Get creative, do something different that's not already out there and do something funny. Usually the funny ones do the best uh, for ugly Christmas sweaters because that's kind of what it is. It's ugly Christmas and you know, they want something funny on there. So hopefully these help you get some sales this Q4 or next Q4 for Christmas. Now these are only great for Christmas time, but they can do really well for Christmas. If you wanna see another video about placement, place it, uh, including the Place It app, I, I made this video right here for the Place It app where you can use it on your phone. I think it's really cool. Thanks again for watching. And as always guys, keep creating and keep learning. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.